da da cha da da ba 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 bam it's gin and tonic and that was my intro music to tea time with gin this week featuring the one and only woo mm -hmm. nymph gwendolyn jane back here miss sexy ass so we're uh we're gonna try and do this all in one take because uh i'm sick of it <laughs> how long did i settle that video last week she was she here <laughs> The majority of 24 hours. <laughs> yes, for real. It was probably 12 hours of solid editing. Of solid time. editing. And that video is garbage. It was bullshit. So cheers. <laughs> cheers. So we are hanging around outside because, I mean, it's a beautiful brown day in LA. Fucking like summer in February. So why not? Yeah. Welcome. Mm. Parking lot party. Pat and my neighbors don't think I'm weird enough yet. I swear. We like, there's a little doggy. It's gone. And we're like, oh, I like your dog. And the woman just like, she did not like us. She did not like you. She did not. Well, I guess like my first day living here was that I had that body paint shoot with Trina Mary. So I'm walking across the whole parking lot just covered in paint. And, and fuck ass naked. Pretty much. And there's just like, <laughs> those of you unfamiliar with Gwen's work, she's been staying with me. She's the best fine art nude model. And uh, you got quite the compliment recently on your titties. I did. Well, it was really fantastic. They're apparently made of unicorn kisses, and then they're sugar coated. Oh, See? are they gonna come out? Ooh, see? yeah. And true it's story. True, I've seen them. I'll put true her links below. Story. You can see them. They're out. By the way, speaking of true story. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be on How I Met Your Mother tomorrow. I'm, I'm probably so not jealous supposed to say that. Even give a shit. Now I'm gonna say what show you're on. Oh well. I won't say what show she's on. But I she's here in LA. A lot of money. <laughs> a lot of money. I signed that you can take all my money mm -hmm. and I will live the entire rest of my life in debt I'm if not I say anything. No, I won't tell, but she is here in LA for a few weeks and we've just been kind of modeling it up and uh, which involves a lot of There's a lot of computer typing. <laughs> of computer typing. And she's also been motivating me with my workouts with Tony Horton, <laughs> mainly drunk. <laughs> I'm a, bitch. a lot of tears too for the time <laughs> time to time a breakdown um, yeah for sure but it's been a blast otherwise <laughs> Gwen brought something to my attention this last week she showed up and she's like oh I feel bad I'm drinking all your water because uh, the water shortage apparently LA is having some big problems we don't <laughs> fuck you what is that oh it's from the sky Woo! I'm kidding no apparently like a drought and there's a water shortage a little bit of a drought so drink more booze mm. drink less water do your part speaking of which la you are not doing your part fucking everywhere i drive has like water fountains and water features and meanwhile the la river is a cement gutter so la if you got the signs up telling us to conserve water how about you take a little fucking responsibility and turn off the damn fountains it's not helping distract from all the litter as much as you fucking think it is not only that you think about it you think of all the theme parks around here how much water they use every day and i'm not saying disneyland should like shut down their water oh, or anything hell no. oh my god there'd be so many pissed people can you <laughs> imagine if pirates shut down for the drought like that's my favorite mm -mm. oh mm -mm. no people would be mad but <laughs> I'm just gonna say, well, a lot of people wouldn't be mad if they did like one day a week or a month or something, and they're just like, we're gonna, you know, save water for a day. I would really respect that move. If more people did something like that, said, hey, we're in the middle of a drought, we're gonna do our part. It's a lot better than rationing your shower time. Yeah, like we have to take shorter showers. Do you know how long it takes to shave? Again, well, not for Gwen. And she's teeny. I no. am teeny. Well, because your leg, your leg just goes like up in the fucking air. I don't know what you do. It's the pretzel shape. It's the pretzel. <laughs> <laughs> She's got skills. This Check. is why you should hire me, Los Angeles. Yes. Don't miss out. Yes. <laughs> don't hire us together though, because her sizes aren't complementary. <laughs> Do you see, other. she's actually like three feet closer to the I, camera than me. Intentionally, because this bitch is very, very tall. Check me? this out. See this shit? Yeah. Next to her, I look like a child in photos, so I don't like that, like short and chubby, so don't do that, like unless you want to take photos separately, that's cool, we have a lot of fun on set, in fact I met this bitch uh, <laughs> on the cruise to Mexico 2012, and uh, there's a blog post about that somewhere there too, I could put the link, it's not very good, but there's some photos, you'll like those, cheers LA, we're gonna get back to being fabulous. And this week, um, I want to give a shout out to no one, because you all suck. Except me. Oh yeah, except her. She's awesome. Thanks, guys.
And this is how we end the night. Fucking drunk bitch music. Vodka. And I have a sucker. I'm chasing with a sucker. She's and I have pickle juice. When you're in a pinch for a chaser for possibly the world. The world's worst. Cheapest plastic bottle oh. vodka. And make life Dude. tolerable. That's much, it's like nail Chuckas. polish in the world. <laughs> it's like nail polish remover. It's still not nice. I don't like it. Mwah. Love you. Kisses.